Let's talk about holding your own intentions first. So as you can imagine, it's very hard to get anything done in today's world unless you hold your own intentions first. You have to prioritize what it is that you need to do and the way that you need to act and the way that you need to do things before everything else. Because otherwise your agenda will be stolen from you very, very quickly. Like I've said before, distractions are not a scarce resource. However, your own attention, your own focus, and your own energy is the most scarce resource that you have, and it's very important that you invest it very, very, very wisely. And so it comes down to that you have to hold your own intentions above everything else if you're going to get anything significant done in today's world. This means that whenever you have to accomplish a task that's really, really important to you, maybe some goal that you're after, or maybe even improving a skill that you want to get really good at, you have to be willing to put everything else aside and really push everyone else out of the way in order for you to go get that. And if you're trying to go for high-end results with anything that you want to do in your life, it's very important that you realize that people are going to come to you and beg and ask for your attention, your time, and your energy, and sometimes they will be even more rude than just trying to take it away from you, pull your agenda from you, and put their own in front of yours. And at that point, you have to put together all the personal power that you have and say no. You have to learn to say no to people that are pulling you off away from your goals, away from your intentions, and towards theirs instead. So unless these two intentions, yours and theirs, align, in some way or another, you have to be willing to say no, push them away and say I'm going to go ahead and do what I need to do in order to get to where I want to be. And if you want to be highly successful, dabbling is not something that you want to engage in and so if anyone is trying to pull you aside to do some stupid thing that isn't going to help you move forward, you have to be willing to decline it and say no and I'm going to move forward and I'm going to do what I need to do in order to get to where I want to be because I know what it takes. Now most people claim that they're able to say no and they in fact will not admit that they do not have the ability to decline offers from people or decline other people's agendas and put their own first. People will say yes, of course I can put myself first, but in reality when someone comes and asks for your attention, if it's something urgent or they make it seem like it's urgent, you go and you fall off your tracks and all of a sudden before you know it, a lot of time has passed and you're stuck where you were maybe 10 months ago, maybe 10 days ago, maybe 10 hours ago. No matter how much time has passed, it's slowing you down and you have to be willing to say no because look that progress that you're losing in those hours might be the most vital progress that you can make and if you want to get to the top it's very essential that you get absolutely all the progress that you can you have to do what it takes in order to accomplish your goals and remember you can't help others until you help yourself 